All right, guys, I'm just going to do a quick video to show you how I'm going to use this wood repair kit that I picked up from Hemaru down at Logan. I have no affiliation with Hemaru. I do know Nathan, I've met him briefly. He's a good bloke, so I thought I'd just do a quick uh, video to showcase how this wood filler and uh, not filler system works. Essentially, this is just like an oversized glorified hot glue gun and it comes with some aluminium cooling blocks. I didn't get the full big kit. There's an other one that's got a huge aluminium block that comes with it. Um, and then it comes with this flat plane scraper that you can um, use at the end. Uh, when I saw some other people's videos, I was a bit worried that this tool itself would be a little bit flimsy and like a little bit dodge, but this is actually quite a sturdy, solid plane iron at the bottom of the scraper. So I'm very impressed with the sturdiness of this. That's, that's the only concern I had uh, coming into it. So I'm just going to get straight into it, guys. I've got a knot here, timber knot, in a bit of camp for laurel. And what I'm going to do is just inject heap of this wood filler in here. And then I'm going to place these cooling blocks on top. I'll probably upgrade to the larger size cooling block at some stage, but this is, uh, this is going to do me for now. That cools actually quite quickly. Okay, so once I remove these cooling blocks, See that the polymer is basically already set. Now I'm going to use this flat scraper to remove that off and then give it a sand. Alright, so it's quite easy. I'm just going to move slightly side to side as I pass through the polymer. And then I'm going to give that a quick sand. Got a bit of a bubble in there, but I can do a bit of a touch up. But uh, yeah, it looks a bit, a bit better than it was. So just quickly, my first thoughts on this system is that it's gonna be uh, a, a bit of a game changer for me filling in my knots because I don't have to wait for the um, drying time or the setting time for the resin that I used to use. It's a lot less messy. I used to have to mix up a lot of resin um, and it, it'd have to sit for so long and I don't really have a dust-free environment at the moment, so the quicker something sets and dries, uh, the better. So I'm gonna basically eliminate most of the resin stuff out of my processes from this point forward. Um, the only bad thing that I can think of, off the top of my head, I've only used this a couple of times, is that once the cartridge is in, um, especially with the shorter cartridges, once it goes past the end of this part, it's very difficult, if not impossible, to get that cartridge out. So you almost have to turn it all on, turn it on, and pump the trigger until it's just wasted out the front. So um, if you're going to be using multiple different colours, I'd suggest just use the smaller sticks. But I'm essentially only going to be using black, so I order ordered in the larger sticks, and I'll continue to do that. But um, what I'm really looking forward to doing is trying it out on some uh, customised cutting boards and things like that. So I do a lot of engraving and personalisation. I think it would take that engraving to the next level by engraving a little bit deeper on the laser cutter and injecting this polymer wood filler into that laser engraving and sanding that back. It's just going to increase the aesthetics of those products that I've got. I've also been thinking about some artwork that I wanted to do. I've been vectorising some of the drawings that I used to do as a kid. And I really want to laser engrave those into some timber and then inject it with this polymer filler and sand it back and see how that looks. So stick around for that. Um, hit a like, follow, hit uh, hit Nathan up for one of these down at Hemaru in Logan if you want to get amongst it. Um, it's a really good, versatile product and I think it's going to, um, you're going to see a lot more of these being used around the place. All right, I'm out. Have a good Christmas. See you later.